So we are here in ACC screen and wanted to see what is the major differences happen in the FS00 screen of ECC versus S4 HANA. So in this particular screen uh, of ECC, we have a selection of either we can select PNL statement or a balance sheet account. In S4 HANA, so if we go to the S4 HANA, we see under account type, we have the option of balance sheet account. For PNL, we have either non-operating expenses or income or a primary cost and revenue. Then uh, the secondary cost, that is secondary cost elements is also a part of now our uh, GL account creation and the cash accounts. So these are the five different uh, types is been added. And like uh, uh, here in the ECC. So in the ECC, we were having only two options. One is either you have to select PNL or a balance sheet. And for any PNL account, if you want to create as a cost element, we have to select this cost element tab here. And uh, it will take you to, yeah, it will take you to the cost element uh, details here. And we need to select properly what is the cost element category and all. Basically, it is a balance sheet account has been created uh, by someone. So I'm just uh, explaining. Now, okay, so here we'll see. So these are the five options which we have here. Now what we will do is we'll explore all the five options. So the first will click on change. So if I select non-operating, it will work as a PNL uh, transaction only. If I go to a control data, so we will not see any cost element tab here. Okay, now I will try to create this as a primary cost or a revenue account. So if I go to a control data, so you will see a cost element. So whenever we need to create anything as a, a cost element, so then you have to select this option, primary cost and revenue. Then I will go to a secondary cost also. So for the secondary cost also, it will automatically activate a cost element category. So whatever the secondary cost element is there, so what that we need to select. So I'm not going on a details of the GL account here. I'm just explaining when the cost element will activate. So only for the primary and the secondary cost only, the cost element will get activated. And this balance sheet is normal balance sheet and the PNL we here PNL, but uh, no cost element is needed. PNL with a cost element needed, secondary with a cost element is needed. And the cash account, under the cash account, we will have a if we create any GL account as a cost uh, cash account. So here we have the three options. So if you are creating a main account, so you will be selecting this as a main account. After that, uh, if you are creating any sub accounts, so you will be selecting this option for sub account. And uh, if you are cre creating a petty cash account, so you will be selecting this option. So for sub accounts, when you are creating a sub accounts, so we need to give a reconciliation account also. So whatever the main account we have created, so that main account, we have to give it as a reconciliation account for the sub account. Thank you.